I feel like uh, painting the Savior for me is a mission. Tonight I urge you with all the hope of my heart to pray to understand your spiritual gifts, to cultivate, use, and expand them even more than you ever have. You will change the world as you do so. He has given us gifts, and in those gifts, we come closer to Him by using them, no matter what it is. It might be a simple gift of kindness or love or charity. You have the capacity to sense what someone needs and when they need it. Sometimes it's words to give to a friend. Follow your feelings. You can reach out, comfort, teach, and strengthen someone in his or her very moment of need. The center of the painting is a young woman. He is gathering her in, in his arms, by first putting his hands upon her head. And that young woman represents all of us. It represents you. There's times we need that. There's times we need his arms encircling us when we can't handle it or when we are excited about something. He still has his hands upon us and he is willing to do that. I know women who pray every day. Whom wouldst thou have me help today? I believe if you ask your Heavenly Father, is there someone there? Or is there someone I need to reach today? He will give you that job. And he'll guide you to that person. There are certain things he would have us do. My dear sisters, you have special spiritual gifts and propensities. Shape the future by helping to gather scattered Israel. This gathering is the greatest challenge and the greatest cause and the greatest work on earth today. It is a cause that desperately needs women because women shape the future. Be intentional about talking of Christ, rejoicing in Christ, and preaching of Christ with your families and friends and changes, even miracles, will begin to happen. Dear sisters, we need you. We need your strength, your conversion, your conviction, your ability to lead, your wisdom, and your voices. We simply cannot gather Israel without you. I love you and thank you. And now bless you with the ability to leave the world behind as you assist in this crucial and urgent work. Together we can do all that our Heavenly Father needs us to do to prepare the world for the second coming of His beloved Son. Jesus is the Christ. This is His church. Of this I testify. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen.